Hi, I'm Katie with Get Out There Magazine, and I'm here today in Woody Point getting ready to participate in Trails, Tales, and Tunes Bombay Loop Bike Ride event. The Bombay Loop Ride happens every May long weekend in conjunction with the Trails, Tales, and Tunes Festival in Norris Point. This event is the cycling season opener for the West Coast Cycling Association. There are three levels of difficulty for the ride the 30 kilometer Lighthouse Loop, 75 kilometer Bombay Loop, and the 90 kilometer Bombay plus Rocky Harbor Loop. All rides are very hilly, with the 75 and 90 kilometer rides being very challenging. Registration for the longer rides takes place in Norris Point, with participants loading the ferry at 9.30 a.m. to transfer to Woody Point and the start line. I caught up with first-time Bombay Loop rider Alice Will for her thoughts on the event. I'm doing 75 kilometers. There are several hills, so the Struggle and Southeast uh, Hill. I'm excited and a little bit nervous. The ride briefing was given and the big loop riders were underway by 10 a.m. The 30-kilometer lighthouse loop ride kicked off at 11.30 a.m. in Norris Point with all participants finishing the ride in about two hours. All the bike routes are inside Grosmorne National Park and include spectacular views of the Tablelands, Bond Bay, and Grosmorne Mountain. Overall, the event went very smoothly, with shuttles running on time and the signage and volunteers were all well placed. Post race, there was a barbecue with drinks and live music inside the cat stop. This year, the event saw its biggest turnout to date, with 54 participants. Race organizers Ryan Butt and Sue Rendell were very involved throughout the event. Big thanks to all the volunteers who made the event possible. For Get Out There Magazine, I'm Katie. Thanks for watching my review of the Bombay Loop. Be sure to follow Get Out There Magazine on our YouTube channel.